the December Festival Hurdle is next, and this is another Grade 1. This is two mile one furlong this time on El Tarbo for Darren Thompson's at the top. Finals for David Hooley, King of Spades for Ryan Tamasebi, Little Dean, Little Dean Guidance for James Shane, Marsh's Zoos for Craig Allen, Enjoy the Silence, Leon van Rensburg, First Lot, David Hooley, Rule of May is Craig Allen, and the Lady Champion for Joshua Sutherland. So just nine then in this. In cordon and away they go. There's Little Dean Guidance in the green jacket, the first one to show as they're being driven towards the first hurdle finals in the purple on the inside is now taking it up on that one is the new leader with some giant daffodils sprouting on the inside of the track i'm sure they're probably not daffodils but they look a bit like them anyway they're all over the first they've got another eight to take so nine in all and finals and little dean guidance are disputing the lead from first lot back in third then rule of maze is fourth then comes el tarbo and the lady champion with tucked in on the rail marshes zoos and the back two are enjoying the silence and King of Spades, who is the back marker at this point in the race. But there's a long way to go yet. Still got 14 furlongs to go. And they come down to the second. And they're all safely over the second. Hurdle in nice, small looking hurdles, these. And Little Dean Guidance is three quarters of a length in the lead of finals in second. As they come up past the big screen, past the winning post shortly. They'll have a complete circuit to go. There's the winning post, there's the total eyes aboard. And they'll swing left handed shortly uh, for one more circuit of the track. And Little Dean Guidance is the leader on the outside of finals. Those two are about four lengths clear of final stable mate, Little Lot, or first lot even. Then Rule of Mazes after that one, and then Lady Champion and Marshy Zoos, and then El Tarbo as they get over number three, which they're all safely over. And Little Dean Guidance is the leader by three quarters of a length. So they get over number four, which they're all to the other side of. And the two black horses in the lead there, then Little Dean Guidance in finals, with a lady champion on first lot chasing them. Then Rule of Maze after that one with El Tarbo and Enjoy the Silence, Marsh's Zoos. And finally, King of Spades with a white face and the four white socks at the back, similar to enjoy the silence as well so racing down towards the next end they're coming down towards the final mile in the race then now they're just about past the halfway point and finals and little dean guidance are still disputing the lead they get over number five and they're all safely over that one with the lady champion back in third and first lot fourth then rule of maze being chased by his stable companion marshy's zoos enjoy the silence getting a little bit closer as el tarbo has just dropped towards the back a little bit and king of spades is still the back marker with all the field in shot and keeping his eye out as to where he wants to go they skip over number six and there's that odd bunch of race guys that are standing right in the middle of the course facing the wrong way from the finish what, what they're doing there goodness only knows but it's finals in the lead then by half a length to little dean guidance in second the lady champion is third then marshy zoos now moved into fourth as first lot starting to drop away a little bit over the seventh and they've just got two more to take in there and the field are beginning to chase this leader now they're beginning to bunch up behind him and it's finals who's still in the lead but marshy zoos and the lady champion looks to be going well enjoy the silence is sweeping through so to his rule of maze it's still a wide open race they've got to get past finals those battling on bravely in the lead finals is in the lead marshy zoos is second rule of maze looks to be going better than anything as they get over the second last and rule of maze now comes to challenge for the leaders they swing into the straight it's finals on the inside with the craig allen pair challenging rule of maze and marcy zoos then after that one comes enjoy the silence they're racing down towards the final flight then now and it's marshy zoos who's poked its head in front marshy zoos in the lead then from rule of maze and finals and then comes enjoy the silence surely between these then with just one to take and marshy zoos is now gone by a length and a half marshy zoos over the final flight he goes marshy zoos in front finals trying to chase in second rule of maze flattered to deceive only that one petered right out didn't it but now trying to come back again as marshy zoos the jockey's tied up on it and final sweeps back into the lead and finals is going to steal it on the line finals ends up taking him by two lengths i don't know what was going on with a cray allen pair there one of them looked like it was going like an absolute train and then just stopped and then the other one was in the lead and that just stopped as well so I'm quite sure what happened to those two but finals looked beaten at one point and has battled back and has ended up winning it by a good two lengths i would say and the joshua sutherland horse nearly caught the craig allen pair for the minor honours as well so finals wins it for david hooley marshes zoos for craig allen second rule of maze for the same trainer third lady champion for joshua sutherland was fourth and enjoy the silence for leon van rinsburg was fifth